y'all, it's Betsy from Happily Ever After, etc. And welcome back to another Pandora video. So this video is a little late, but that's because I actually picked up some charms and bracelet, or my mom did, when she was in Spain several weeks ago on the sale that they were having. So the sale in America was buy a bracelet and three charms, I believe for $159. Um, which is not a bad sale at all, but the sale in Spain where my mom was, was buy a bracelet and two charms for 99 um, euros. And they had a very different selection from the two places. So in America, when I would go on the website to take a look, they only had one option for the bracelet. And if you didn't like it, that was the option. Um, some of the stores had like an upgrade option where you could pay more to get a rose gold bracelet or a gold bracelet or just a different style bracelet. But for the $159, it was the one style. Whereas in Spain, they had four or five different styles. Um, and so I, <laughs> my mom called and woke me up at 6.30 in the morning, my time, because it was the middle of the afternoon, her time in Spain, in La Corona where she was. And she was like, they're having this sale. Do you want... Do you want a bracelet and some charms? I'm getting one. And so I was like, obviously I want a bracelet and charms. What kind of a question is that? And so she grabbed me a heart class bracelet and two of the brand new ice blue snowflake Muranos, which were on the sale for 99 euros, which I thought was a great deal. I was going to get these Muranos anyways for my Christmas bracelet. I also was looking for a new Christmas bracelet because mine is just a smidge small and I knew I wanted to put Muranos on it. So I was like, this is great. I can get the new Christmas bracelet and the two new Muranos for that bracelet. One fell swoop, 99 euros. That's fabulous. Um, and it's the heart clasp, which is the one I prefer for the basic bracelets as opposed to just the barrel clasp, which was the one on sale in the United States. So I was very excited. Um, she finally got back from her cruise on the carnival celebration. We're going to be doing a question and answer all about her cruise or being on an inaugural sailing or being on a transatlantic sailing. So if you have any questions about that, leave it down below and I will ask her those questions in our question and answer video. But I'm going to open these and I'm going to put all my Christmas beads together. I'm super excited. I want to see how they all look. But I was going to show you my bracelet and the two charms I got and mom's bracelet and the two charms she got. But the sales gal at Pandora put both bracelets on my mom's wrist and not half an hour later, literally seven in the morning, my mom called me crying because her bracelet came loose and fell off somewhere in the streets of La Corona, which was just awful. She's still upset. And of course, Pandora doesn't really cover lost pieces, but I'm like, for that bracelet to come off immediately when the sales girl just put it on your wrist, like it usually takes me help in a clasp opener to get a brand new bracelet off. They're usually not loose like that yet. I'm like that bracelet, like either something was funny with it or she did not put it on properly. And this is why I don't wear things until I have a safety chain, but you know, she was in Spain. She was excited. She just, she just went with it and now she's upset. So I'm going to give her the slightly smaller bracelet that I'm not a fan of that I had all my Christmas beads on. It was a red um, CZ clasped bracelet, which she's doing a red Christmas bracelet, which is what she was getting her heart chain for anyways. So it's not a total loss. It means I lose a bracelet, but at least that helped her feel a little bit better. But I'm so sad that she lost her brand new bracelet with her two new charms on it. And of course I can't replace the charms. I'm not a magician. So we'll see. She may be getting some of those for Christmas. I may replace them that way, but can't show you her bracelet and charms because they are gone. It was the heart class bracelet, the, another ocean Murano and the little suitcase charm. So I will show you mine and then um, I will link below to my full Christmas bracelet. Once I open these, I'm going to put my whole Christmas bracelet together and I will do a video showing you all of those charms as well. But I'll probably give you at least a sneak peek of my Christmas bracelet at the end of this video, just if you want to go charm by charm. 
go check out the Christmas bracelet video. For now, I want to get into this box. I'm so excited. All right, I'm so excited. So let's open this up and see, see the Muranos. I mean, the bracelet is exciting too because I didn't need a new bracelet, but it's just a heart clasp. I'm really excited about those Muranos. Oh my God, oh my God, I already dropped it. I already dropped it. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh, I was worried. I was worried because so many people who have seen them in person said they weren't that blue, but y'all, those are blue. What are y'all talking about? So you can see the bracelet is just the standard heart clasp. It says Pandora. And on the other side, it has the logo, that little O with the crown. And then she did, I guess the sales girl put the charms on, or maybe mom did, but they came in the box. I can't imagine mom opened the box to put these on. So I, I'm so excited. Right, I'm gonna take them off so that we can look at them up close. See, look how hard that is to open. Like, there's no way that would just come off. I'm so frustrated. Mom doesn't know any better. This is the first bracelet she's bought without me. And I just, Either something was wrong with it or the sales girl did not clasp it properly. And the sales girl closes bracelets all day long, you know? So I don't know what to think, but we're gonna focus on my bracelet because I have it. Look at those snowflakes. I love, I have never been a huge fan of Murano's. I'm just, ugh. Just am not a huge fan of the ovalness of them, which I know sounds just ridiculously petty and picky, but I'm just not. I would rather buy, um, like on here when they had the the petite round beads. I would prefer those, but they don't really make those as much anymore. And when they've been coming out with these Muranos. With the side pieces, I will buy those all day long. I love these side details. They are so pretty. I have the star ones. I have the rose gold hearts. I have silver hearts. I have going to get the new red ones. Like, I, I just want all of them. So as soon as these came out, I was like, okay, obviously I need that. And they have like the little glints of silver inside. And of course, I know some people are really picky when they get Murano's about making sure they match, which I totally understand. These particular Murano's do not seem to vary enough. Um, like the ocean Murano's vary a lot. These, I think you're going to be safe with regardless of if you're double checking them or not, they seem to be very similar. I think the only thing that might be different is if you got a set with maybe a lot of sparkle inside and no sparkle inside, but all of the ones I've seen seem very similar, which is good. You could order these from the website and I think they're going to match just fine. I'm not a huge, I'm not huge on matching, but if I got a set that looked nothing alike, I'd be very upset. I'm enough of a matcher for that at least. And the hallmarks are just on the one side. S925, ALE, and then Pandora. I love it. So I'm so excited as well because the bracelet, this bracelet is a 7.9, which is my standard size. The other bracelet, the one I'm giving my mom, is a 7.1, which is just a little small for me but I'd ordered it from Rue Lola and it was just the only size they had. And I figured it's fine. I'm not putting Murano's on it. And then these came out and everything changed. I was like, oh man, I'm gonna have to get a bigger bracelet. So this worked perfectly. Mom has already claimed her bracelet. So all of my charms are living on this charm bar. So give me a minute. I'm gonna go ahead and assemble it and then I will give y'all a little sneak peek. All right, so here's a sneak peek 
of the whole thing put together, bracelet, beads, the whole nine. Um, again, if you want to go charm by charm, I will link my Christmas video down below, but the bracelet is just your standard heart clasp and the stars of the show of this whole bracelet really are those brand new winter ice blue Murano's. I was not sure about them. I had heard that they weren't as blue as you'd want them to be. And maybe they aren't with a lot of other blues like my winter bracelet blues, right? These are blue, blue, blue. I, I'm gonna wear these stacked, totally wear these stacked. But despite them not being that dark navy blue, they are definitely ice blue. I am so glad I got them. I kind of want two more to go on the ends, but I'm afraid that will just fill up my bracelet. So if you want, I will leave a link below. You can check out the whole winter bracelet, but leave a comment down below. Do you think I should snap up two more of these while they're on Black Friday sale for the ends? Or do you think I should wait and leave that space open for more actual charms? I don't know. I love it. I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.